In this crash test video, the driver is wearing a seat belt, but the backseat passenger is not and slams into the front seat, then is tossed to the roof. Government data shows in 2019, almost half of people killed in car accidents were not wearing a seat belt. The seat belt is the most important safety feature that a vehicle has. David Harkey is the president of the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety and says under current federal standards, seatbelt reminders only need to last a few seconds. Our goal is to go well beyond the federal standards. We want to push that audible and visual signal to last 90 seconds and for it to be loud enough, let's call it a more annoying warning, that would get drivers to buckle up their seat belt. The IIHS also wants a visual reminder for backseat passengers. With that criteria in mind, the group tested 26 SUVs and only two, the Subaru Forester and Subaru Ascent, received a good rating. 12 others were given an acceptable or marginal grade. And almost half get a poor rating. IIHS research shows persistent alerts can increase seatbelt use up to 34%. Most of the changes that we're talking about with uh, making these, these audible changes is software. And so it's not a hardware change. And so we think most of the automakers will be able to make this change quickly. Harkey says those changes could save around 1,500 lives a year. Laura Podesta, CBS News, New York.